have been trying to film this for the past 10 minutes and my light keeps shutting off. Anyways, welcome back to my channel guys. Today's video I think is going to be a, like a payday routine type thing. I love watching these videos on YouTube. They're so satisfying. So I figured I would do one myself. I want to say some things before I start. My last video um, was my debt check-in and you guys are being so nice to me in the comments. It's so fun to like start to get interaction back from people because for the longest time I was not there was nothing like people weren't subscribing people weren't commenting so it's fun to like see the the little interactions between you guys you guys have been so nice to me so thank you um and if you're watching and you're not subscribed already go for it it's free it was, oh Yes, I'm going to be doing a payday routine today. I'm pretty excited about this. Like I said, I love watching them. I think they're fascinating. Um, I'm not sure why. I think it's genuinely just because we're all nosy. So now that we got our paydays and like our taxes and stuff figured out, because for a long time they were kind of funky, um, I did get my pay stub today. Um, technically, this is the day before payday. But we can, she'll send us our pay subs and we can see them the day, the evening prior to payday, I guess. Uh, so I'm going to use my pay stub here um, and work with this information. I normally don't budget out my entire check. I leave like a buffer, I guess, in my account. So I'm going to go ahead and budget this out. But let me show you what I use to budget out my paychecks. Um, I got into Canva and created my own little budget sheet. I kind of want to make like a little binder with like denomination sheets and like with a bunch of these in it. Uh, but let me flip you around and show you what this has on it. So these are great. Like I said, you can find them on canva.com. You don't have to have a subscription or anything to make them. Um, you get, you can like choose from a, a few different templates that you can customize and make your own. Excuse the paint on my hand. So this is kind of what I have done with mine. I have my income box up here and then I have like my fixed expenses. This is where I put like bills. Yeah, bills. Uh, I don't have any subscriptions. So, well, I have subscriptions, but I literally leech them off of my family. So I don't pay for any of them. <laughs> There's a finance life hack. If you can leech off your subscriptions and like streaming services from your family, do that. <laughs> I'm very thankful I don't have to pay for Netflix or like Hulu or Disney Plus, things like that. So next down here I have my variable expenses. This is like groceries, wallet, wallet stuff. Stuff that is um, changing and isn't like too, too, like is not the same amount each pay period if that makes sense. I have a fat fat box for my sinking funds. I do think I have a couple extra spaces here but this sinking funds pretty much fills up my my yeah. Uh, up here I have an extra debt payment. This is really where I'm putting my credit cards. Other than my credit cards I'm not really in extra debt per se. So yeah that's just really just where I put my credit cards. And then any savings challenges that I might have go down here. So that's kind of the layout of my little budget sheet. And then if I, I figured this would be helpful, but I honestly, I don't even use it uh, to put like the, the dates up here of the pay period. So yeah, that's what I'm going to be using. So that being said, let's go ahead and budget out my paycheck together. So I'm going to go ahead and pull up my pay stub. Oh, real quick. Wow, she's gorgeous. Okay, I'm going to pull in my pay stub here, and I'm going to decide how much I want to budget out. Um, like I said, I don't really ever do the full amount. I'm just going to put the, the like, paid day, and then I'm going to budget out $760. we are going to work from there. I'm going to go into my calendar. Uh, and kind of go through what bills I have for this pay period. I pull rent out of every single check, so we're gonna do that 125. And then um, I know my phone is due. Let me check my account balance right quick because I have a 
car insurance check that is supposed to come out but I don't think it will be subtracted from this amount so I might not even need to worry about it my uh, water and gas I need to stuff I'm also going to go ahead and put um, my Amazon on here. I believe my Amazon Prime will come out of this paycheck. I think that's it. My phone is... Let's just take a look here. $120.79, but we're just going to do $120. Water and gas, I'm going to do 40 That pretty much doesn't change. And then Amazon is, what, 15 I think. That is the only subscription I pay for on a monthly basis. I lied to you guys, and I apologize about that. So my wallet expenses don't... The categories and the amounts don't ever change. Did I spell that right? It looks wrong. Gas, groceries eating out which lord knows i do not need and then spending in miscellaneous like i said the amounts don't ever really change i'm gonna put the same amount in each of them as i did last time groceries 130 gas 130 40 eating out spending i think i'm gonna do Maybe I'll just do like 10 and then miscellaneous gets 10 as well. So now before moving on any further, I guess this has kind of turned into a budget with me. Before moving any further, I'm going to add up all of these. Wow, and that comes out to an even 300. Then I'm going to add up these. And that is an even 220. All right. Tell me why we all, you guys do that too. Like, better make sure it's cleared. So we're gonna do 760 minus 300, and that's 460. And then we're gonna do 460 minus 220, and that's 240. And then I'm, I've just kind of been writing up here um, $100 and then whatever card that that needs to go on, I'll just pay that amount. Um, so we've got $140 remaining. Now I'm going to go ahead and write out all my sinking funds really quick. Now, I have um, my medical sinking fund always gets 50 until I can get my medical bill paid off. It's going to keep getting 50. So, uh, the next thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to pull out my, I don't think there's, um, oh yeah, there is. Okay. I'm going to pull out my, the sinking funds that I have trackers in and see if there's anything that I can like, cross off. I knew this pay period I wanted to like put more towards a couple things so um, we probably won't stuff most of these honestly. Oh my gosh it is so hot in this front room. We have one AC unit in our house like a window unit. I'll probably have to speed up a lot of that because I just get so like I get far too rambly. Yeah see sometimes it's trial and error you gotta you gotta just go through. So medical's getting 50 that's that car needs to get 40. I need to start like really buckling down on myself to save for a car. Car maintenance should get 15. Um, and then car tags doesn't need 15. So let's take that out. Credit card debt could get 15. Zena needs her 20. And that's that. So Grayson is not getting anything this paycheck. Okay. That was 140. Okay, there we go. 
so like self-conscious that I'm gonna add something up wrong because that has happened to me before. I like total out my, um, what is it called? This. I like total out this wrong and they look at me like I'm a complete idiot. Like how does this grown ass woman not know how to do basic math? Um, I don't, that's what this is for. So cool. So I'm gonna keep my little budget sheet here uh, and I'm gonna do cash denominations here. So we will be cashed up in $525 tomorrow. Anyways, I'll see you guys tomorrow for the rest of this video. This was more like a budget with me portion of it, I guess, uh, which I didn't intend on doing, but it's fine. Bye. It's a new day. The next thing I'm gonna do is double check here real quick that my paycheck did hit my bank account. Yes, okay, I'm good. So here tucked away in my wallet, whoops, right here, I have my cash slip. Um, so I'm gonna take that to the bank real quick and I'm gonna get the denominations out and we'll see you at the bank. Okay, so I'm at the bank and I'm going to get my cash. Hello. I was just wondering if I could grab this out of my checking. Thank you, you as well. Thank you. <clears throat> then, oh, I'm flashing you my bank. Whoops. Then, oh. I try to pull out of the driveway. You literally cannot see anything. I think I'm good. We're winging it. Apparently, we're winging it with a tripod as well. I'm gonna insert a picture of what you guys look like sitting up there. So now I've pulled over to the side and I am gonna count this to make sure that it's right because I have a fear of getting back home and it just not, like absolutely being wrong. This is also the time where you guys know how much I hate they don't face your bills. Um, this is drug money. Wow, that's drug money for sure. So I'm gonna go ahead and give this a quick count. Okay, yeah, it's good. Now I'm gonna go home and then I'm gonna cash stuff it and I will film that as well and that video will be out probably Monday. So yeah, I hope this was kind of a chaotic video. So yeah, I'm gonna take my drug money and I'm gonna go home and we're gonna cash stuff it. Until next time, I'll see you guys in my next video.